What's up everybody, Flip here, EUC Chronicles back with another goodie. Before we kick this video off, I have to give a big super duper shout out to Sensei Vegan. Sensei, brother, I cannot thank you enough. Also, shouts out goes out to CJ because if it wasn't for CJ, this video would not be possible as well. But first and foremost, so last video I was saying that I was in the middle of doing something and I was being very vague of what I was doing. What I was actually doing was in the middle of buying a V11. And I had the V11 in my cart. I was all ready to hit, I had the shipping address, everything in there. And after some convincing to myself i decided not to buy it at this time only because the winter time was coming and it's just like yeah it'll be great to have a nice new wheel but at the same time you're not gonna get to take advantage of it due to the weather and you know for other reasons i was just like you know what i'll wait and as much as i didn't want to do it i did it and then about three days later I wake up to a text on my phone from Sensei saying, Hey brother, my apologies for disturbing you, but I had to reach out to you because I know you were saying you wanted a V11. Are you still interested in buying one? And obviously my answer was yes. So he says, well, brother, I got a deal for you. And he proceeded to tell me how CJ was in the middle of selling his V11. And if I was interested to hit him up and you know, he said he could have got it for himself, but he figured, Hey, he knew I was looking for one. So he reached out and told me to hit CJ up. So I did, I reached out to CJ that <laughs> few minutes after our conversation. And I said, hey, man, I hear you're selling the V11. Do you still have it? And is it available? And he said, yes, it is. And he gave me an a, a offer I couldn't refuse. And I was like, sold. Sent them the money immediately. Made arrangements for the unit to be picked up from his house and delivered to my house. And I just received it yesterday as you're watching this video. And this is me going out for a maiden voyage. And I know, I know, I know I'm not wearing any gear. I know it's extremely stupid and foolhardy for me to ride on a wheel that I just got from technically a stranger and go out and <laughs> test ride it with no gear. But I felt really, really good about this wheel. I felt very safe. Sometimes you see something or you get on something and you say, hey, that's sketchy. I don't want to do that. But when it came to this wheel, I, I just, I felt absolutely safe. I didn't think at all anything was going to transpire and it didn't. So I just went out, gave it a spin around the block a little bit. And then my son and I, we actually went out for a group ride afterwards, but I didn't film that. But um, I'm loving the wheel, man. And and, and I'm glad I waited and, and waiting was everything. I, I, I could have bought it. I could have bought the thing three days ago, you know? And, uh, well, more than three days ago, but when I had it in my cart, but you know, I decided to wait a minute and I ended up getting the wheel cheaper than I would have got it from the store I was buying it from. So once again, I have to thank you, Sensei, my brother for hitting me up. It is much appreciated. CJ also, thank you for selling me this wheel in pristine condition. I am blown away about how clean this wheel is. As you can see in the video, there's very few scuffs, scrapes, or anything on this wheel. So I, I am much appreciative, and uh, you will see more videos in the future. And we'll talk about this wheel more in depth once I get some time with it. I'm going to spend this whole week riding it, and then I will give you my own personal review and analysis of this wheel. But I'm extremely happy to have it, and thank you guys for watching. See you in the next one. Peace.